Finn, big game tomorrow. Um, potentially one that could secure the title, um, but it's a it's a tough one away to away to Montrose. Um, what are your kind of thoughts going into it as as maybe the game that you know could be the one that, that secures the league title? Just like any other game, to be fair. Um, obviously, we're playing a half five, so it could be done before the game. But it doesn't matter. We're still wanting to try be unbeaten for the rest of the season, so we're just going to go into it like any other game. They're a tough side, as we know. I don't think we've beat them over two goals. I think it's always been like one nils, two ones, something like that. So hopefully we can just get our heads down and, and win the game. Obviously, confidence sky high going into it. Um, 30 games unbeaten in the league this season. Um, and obviously you guys are determined to kind of go the whole way, go invincible. But for yourself, I think it's your kind of second full season um, being professional. Did you kind of expect to to be in this kind of situation in your in your second season, playing, you know, out of position as well? Um, my first year was a bit like I started off really well, fifteen games I was playing every minute of those games, cups as well, and then I kind of died off a wee bit. But this season, obviously, the change of positions helped me get in the team because obviously we've got a lot of midfielders, a lot of good players as well, and the team's not changed. So in terms of me playing every single game, right back's been pretty good. I've had good exposure. I think I've only missed two games, something like that. So I'm, I'm playing, which is really good. But it's just, I don't know, it's just I always wanted to come in this season hitting hitting hard and, and try to play every game. And even if I thought that was, what, 20 games starts or whatever like that, something, I would have just loved it. But I've played every game and... I can't thank the gaffer enough for playing me. So. Playing as well in a, in a really solid defence that's, um, I think, only conceded maybe 17 or 18 goals um, in the league. How is it playing with, with the rest of um, with the rest of that back line who have done so well this season? Yeah, brilliant from the boys, too fair. It's not just like the back four. It's the goalie, obviously, and then you, the attackers. The more, the more they do up top, the less we have to do at the back. Um, Cal Morrison's helped tra track him back, so it, it does help a lot. I mean, Cole Donaldson's taken the armband and he's been, everyone can see he's changed a wee bit, he's been a lot more of a leader. Um, Tom's obviously struggling just now, but he was flying, he's an absolute machine. Leon, up and down, Mr. Consistent, as they call him. So, no, it's just been a good gel with the boys and it's fair play to the whole team. Um, the shape that we play in, hard to beat and... Well, I think we've only conceded 18 goals, something like that. So the uh, team as a whole has been brilliant. You mentioned, obviously, just kind of thanking the gaffer for, for giving you that opportunity to, to play in the team, giving you the run that you've had. How would you say he's helped your um, development as well since you've joined the club, obviously, as a, as a young player? Mm -hmm. Well, he obviously signed me when I didn't have a club and I was struggling. Um, he gave me an opportunity uh, in my first game, I think it was Kilmarnock in a friendly, um, he gave me my opportunity and to be fair, I took my opportunity well. Um, obviously, I didn't know that it would lead me to play right back, but um, I've really enjoyed it. And As I said, he gave me an opportunity to play football and I've taken my opportunity and all I can say is thanks to him. And The team's obviously picked itself this year, so in a way, thanking myself, but no, it's, you can't ask for anything more when the gaffer trusts you. To go and play out position and keep you there. And just uh, on a on a personal note, obviously, very very close to securing the title now. Um, how much would it mean to yourself um, to be able to to make that um, to make that possible? Uh, can't put it into words really. Like I never expected to to win a league so soon in my career, and it'd be a, a great thing to have. But it's just brilliant to for what we've done this this season. New records have been broken throughout the start of the season, so I mean, nah, just brilliant from the boys, and can't thank everyone that's helped along the way. Just lastly, um, as well, it's it's been a really the club's been a really positive kind of environment um, this season on the pitch, off the pitch as well with with the fans. Um, their backing has been immense this season, and I think 
around 2,000 are going to be heading um, up to, to Montrose tomorrow. Um, how, how crucial have the fans been this season as well and how much of a lift have they given you guys on the pitch? Yeah, absolutely. They've been fantastic. The ultras especially, they're keeping us going, especially when games aren't going our way recently. It's been quite tough, but you know when they're bouncing, the team normally gets a lift from it and then we go and score another goal or we get an attack and everyone's roaring. So it does help a lot, um, especially when games that we're not winning and they're not booing. I know last season it was a bit frustrating for the fans, rightly so, but I mean, this season they've not, nothing like that. So it's been brilliant from them. Perfect. Thank you very much, Finn, and all the best for tomorrow. Thank you.